That's. I think that's always gonna happen. There's nothing. That, that right side of the screen with the team hey, sixteen by nine just blows me away. Else, okay? I think, like, I'm genuinely curious as to what, like, the original thing looks like. I'm pretty sure it's exactly the same. Yeah. But like, who had sixteen by nine TVs back then? We don't even know for sure if it was her. Well, it was and, and like, I guarantee you, these VHS anime based games. Oh, people had projector TVs. We were yeah, but like. This game, like, Chances anime took so long right. for it to go widescreen, and like, so this was VHS anime way era, like, there's no okay. way that, like, that anime, or like, the anime cutscenes in this would never really not really fall out through. Oh. Hmm. <clears throat> hey, did you hear that weird you thing about The Wire, how, like, we the 16x9 version is really weird? Because it was shot in 4x3, and it uses every bit of space, so 16x9 just has these weird, like, areas of just nothing? Because he shot them with, <laughs> with 16 by 9 we'll like film. Yeah, he shot it with film. Another. Yeah, so you could, so they're there, but you yeah. just didn't use them. Yeah. Um, well, that's what like the joke was when 16 by 9 like started taking off, like when digital TV started coming out. They were like, what? It's like, oh, you're missing out on so much. And then like, um, they would, <laughs> fuck, <laughs> we need to get to a safe place quick. <laughs> Let's go. But yeah, they would show on uh, this one like comedy TV show in Australia they were like oh see look this is just two people so talking to each other but what you don't see is uh, if you don't have 16 by 9 is that they're being attacked by zombies and there's zombies on the outside of the screen like hidden inside the letter boxes yeah. <laughs> but like the reverse of that is that it's just like it's just weirdly buffered because like also the wire is a lot of like people just like talking to each other yeah. which is great because it's, it's meant to be and it's so good at it yeah but like <laughs> if there's people yeah, like not walking you? in or like doing I stuff in the background then like there's no real point to it. it's the same with You're deadwood it's like, father, like deadwood was filmed in 16 by 9 but like you can watch it all the way through and it looks fantastic because like Speak old just woman. dirty cowboys talking to each other like they're, <laughs> they're filthy <daughter>. dirty cowboys <laughs> they're so dirty <laughs> so many times people get like chunked out into the street yeah. and they're just covered in horse shit and like Azelle oh what a fucking brilliant show <laughs> Where like, she? the best thing about Deadwood is that if you don't off. like any of the characters, they're gonna get beat daughter. up and pushed into Kidnapped. shit at some point. <laughs> there was just shit everywhere. <laughs> oh, dude, you're not, I'm not even kidding. The there's literally shit the everywhere. Way. There's their the country the now where there's just shit Jesus. everywhere. Yeah, you could recreate there's Deadwood there. <laughs> now they probably Nothing won't be white, but yeah. But no one looks like because they're all kind of big shit. She sealed them off with a spell. Luckily, that wasn't 30 minutes of See, look at Cleo's hair. Yeah, she's got the Jordan Can't Giovanna look the Tower of Wisdom? <laughs> look at this old lady's face. Yeah. Look at it. Yeah, then a PS2 face. She, she looks like an old Tibetan spell. man. We have almost no <laughs> she looks like Tom Petty. Oh, yeah. We were in the future. Well, I've been reading that part once. I've always finished it. And I'm like... Okay, so find another way in. Joseph is the last guy in the story that has the the ripple. Yeah, uh, you mean Phantom oh, Blood, hello. by the way. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Part One: well. Phantom Blood. I'm heartened. Um, you just said Part One right after we were talking about Deadwood, so I don't want people. To oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But they're using the ripple anywhere. in Deadwood. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that would be amazing because it's set at oh, the same time as Phantom Blood. Sure. 1880s, Hello? huh? Is that it could happen. Yeah, it could happen. Think, think about, think about it. Think about it. Dio just starts beating up miners. Shouldn't you at least pretend to be worried? <laughs> this is my zombie. <laughs> You'd kick minor. me harder for pretending to but, be worried. But uh, anyway, yeah. Th- you're way too so tough to be Joseph killed. is the last That's guy who has the ripple in well, the story. I'm glad to see that everyone like, made it off the boat, okay? What? I can't believe I let you be my Like that's of the the Joe Star crew of the Scooby Gang, you know? Like all the Zeppelins, all the whatevers straights die or whatever all of them the last guy who has it that we see that we know doesn't die that dies last is joseph yeah. everyone else we know dies but um we what we don't know is what happens to tom petty's um tibetan crew like maybe straights kills them all at the start of part two like maybe, yes he does does he does he say like i killed every single one of them yeah because even, didn't want even the younglings them. Uh, <laughs> so supposedly their clan was some of the last because the clan was already dwindling off. Yeah, because a lot of them Tibetan Yeah, and then... And they didn't let foreigners in. The only reason why they let Zeppeli in is because Tom Petty read his mind. Yeah, with the <laughs> Yeah, and he, and he looked into his future and he was like, 
oh, you're gonna die because it, when a kid opens the door, he's like, oh, all right then. <laughs> Dude, definitely dies in the dumbest fucking bit ever. <laughs> there, there are dumber bits. There, there are dumber bits, but like compared to um, Caesar, like his death is just like trash. Like his death is just like, oh, what did he do? Oh, he just got in the way of an attack. Caesar or Zep, uh, Zeppelin? Like Caesar's dad or Zeppelin? Because we never really get to know Caesar's dad. Caesar. Huh? Caesar's dad is not Zeppelin. That's his grandfather. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking about uh, uh, Zeppelin. Okay. Yeah, so I'm saying, like, because he dies in part one. Yeah. When uh, jo uh, Jonathan is fighting Tarkus. Like, the kid opens the door. Spoilers. Yeah, spoilers for something that's Okay, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. We, Look, okay. You I'm, can't I'm, talk I'm to him. I'm pressing the activate button. Can't, can't talk, talk to him like this. Gotta jump up, go up here, and then you pop down there. Did you there. know that there are three towers on this island? <laughs> you love this tower of mercy. <laughs> Me? Socks with the little tiles. They're there. amazing. It's because they don't have elastics. Huh? Yeah. Because what is wrong because this you? is when Dio was born. Dude, I can't What's fucking figure out the time period, right? His socks don't have elastics, but he has a leather jacket, and she has jeans. In fact, I think fucking Zeus has jeans. <laughs> Fred fucking blue jeans. Zeus is wearing cargo pants. <laughs> so yeah, she's wearing blue jeans. <clears throat> this fucking kid's wearing overalls. Oh, I hate that kid so much. a knife? No, a he's knife? got a fife. <laughs> I got two questions. One, where's the five? Two, give, give me, me the, the five. five. I hate this place. Why? <laughs> it reminds me of the orphanage I was in. I had no friends. Nobody cared So yeah, definitely eat shit so because long. the kid opens the door, he just walks in and he's though. like, Oh, I'm gonna help you fight this guy. I'm gonna, gonna release you from your so, from like the contraption you moved into. Huh? And then you Joseph's too? like uh, so yeah. Jonathan's like, Alright, that's cool. <laughs> but then uh Tarkus is like, Nope, and fucking cuts him in half. Jonathan, I'll wake you up. Wake with me the up inside. inside. Can't wake up. But but then yeah, he gets sliced in half, and then he's like, "Oh, I'm gonna give you my my Where's last Samoan ripple, the last of my energy." Until so we find that yeah, and he like touches him, and he gets like do. powered up, and he's like, "Oh, I've right. got so much Samoan right now. You can't even know." My lungs stay. got so much bigger. It's yeah. our fault. <laughs> and no, it's it's, it's your blood and your breathing, and like your oxygen all acting as one. And so he gives him extra gusto or something. Poor Zeus. Like it adds to adds to the chorus of his uh of his ripple. I'm I'm giving you my extra oxy uh, oxygenated blood. <laughs> yes. I have Hep B. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. There has to be some way to get to Jesus. He's like, oh. There must be. There's gotta be more than one guess, entrance I mean, to the fine. underground area. How else am I gonna kill these vampires? Really? That's the ultimate way to kill a vampire. It's like you're sucking your blood. <laughs> I have Hep B. Ah! Okay, so next time you see a vampire, just throw together. Pamela Anderson at them. It's just a hunch. <laughs> But that should mean there's more than one entrance. Oh, so that's why we never find vampires, because they're all going after Pamela Anderson. Never <laughs> give up and they're like, oh no. They, 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 they get a taste of that sweet, collagenated blood. You can thank me after we find your daughter, Zeus. Mm, certainly. Of course, I, I do expect to be rewarded for my trouble. So he yes, did. <laughs> what year is this guy from? I must prepare uh, 2000. for journey. Oh, really? So he never saw the Baywatch movie? The, what, the role that I got an Oscar for? <laughs> Zephy, you made it <laughs> off the ship okay. Yes. I'm happy to oh, see you're man. safe, Orphan. So, did you come here with Magnus? Your drum yes. is real good. <laughs> you have taught him well. I don't Not like this game. Oh, did you ever play the PS2 Futurama game? Uh, no, but I have a question. Yeah. Is this on audio he atrocities? He loves playing. <laughs> the entire <laughs> game on audio atrocities? <laughs> It's actually not. I really. I okay, know. then I guess we need to play through this again to capture all the <laughs> audio clips. I'm gonna submit this to audio shots. But the the clip that I sent you, mm -hmm. uh, well, I sent you a bunch of clips. One of the clips I sent you is from Vampire yeah. Survivor. Uh, oh, oh it's such a good game. Is, wait, is that I the one? It's a like game. Like oh, okay, her. no, I thought it was the one where it was like uh, a Red and Evil game, but with the, vampires. Vampire Countdown. That's it. No, yeah, it's Vampire Countdown. Um, but yeah, it's really good. Like, it's it's actually a really good light gun game. Mm -hmm. Like, it's on the same level as Time Crisis, except you don't duck like in Time Crisis, but there's more power-ups and stuff. And like, every attack you can dodge just by shooting. Is that 
tall gentleman. So like if you learn the game, a like you can, you can beat the whole yeah. game without getting hit pretty easy. He is. I'd feel so same much Tarkas. safer you learn the game if a man beat like it. that, that you beat me. it by shooting. Yeah, those are some flat railings. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, it has like such terrible voice acting, and like, I think that the like, the flattest of banisters. <laughs> what are these barrels doing here? I just realized they're like little barrels of like I water wish or I wine. Could tell you more, master. Speaking of, of wine, let's talk to Magnus. Hmm? <laughs> oh. Also, did you hear the creepy dialogue between uh, what's her name, Sefi? Sefi. Sefi and like. Orphan about a, oh you, oh you trained Magnus well, he, he, he brought me here. He's yeah, like, oh, I'm so glad you're, you're you did a orphan. good job at training this infant. Yeah, <laughs> so shabbily put together. Shit. Hey, so did you know that in Scrum there are some companies that don't use grooming because it tends to have a negative connotation? What they just don't use the word grooming? Yeah, they just call it something else. Training. Yeah. Preparing. No, because it's like you, like, yeah, yeah. Gro grooming has somehow become a term now that it's like, oh, pedophilia. But, like, not just that, but, like, there's so many, like, stupid, um, stupid, like, business terms that get thrown around all the time. Like an activation? Like, oh, and, like, going forward and powwow, and I'm just like, I know you're trying to sound like fucking Gordon Gecko right now, but you actually just sound like a fucking idiot. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, it, like. You can just say in the future instead Master of going forward, orphan. and like instead of power, which is fucking highly offensive to some people. Yeah. Like maybe, okay. maybe just say. Time to get talk. going. Well, Let's I mean, move out. Like there's, yeah. there's normal words for this that we don't we make you sound like a fucking idiot. How do you propose we get into the tunnels <laughs> if we only had a clue of some kind? Like if if you told me, hey, Master. there's a way to make you not sound like an idiot, I'd be like, where is it? <laughs> I'd be like, okay, wait, what, so what book is this? What injection around. is this? <laughs> yeah. how, how do I get my hands on this? How much does it cost me? me? With you <laughs> I don't think I could afford it, but how much is it going to cost me? So here's what I think. I think that yeah. <coughs> I lost my train of thought. <laughs> <laughs> I met someone who just I think that we should move from to vaping to injections. <laughs> that was it. Over there. Directed put on my veins. I saw this video. It's only like five seconds long. But it's this girl, like, and she just smokes this really big vape cloud. And then it just zooms in on this guy's face and he goes, wow. This is Ronnie. <laughs> she knows the island inside out. Maybe she can help. I can't wait for that Hello. vape store video you're gonna put She's up. She's just a kid. <laughs> yeah. Master, I, I have all the props. Ronnie, I just need to this get is my list. teacher. You just Master need that orphan. enormous list. He's not good with first impressions. That enormous phone book of the list. He's pretty bad with them. But he is a good sorcerer. Oh, nice man. to meet you. I considered Morphin? doing a video Morphin? that was no, top 10, Morphin. top 10 list. <laughs> <laughs> I, I saw a... Uh, like one of my favorite memes that are running around right now. Um, yeah. I call them this memes. Is, <laughs> I call them memes uh, because I had to read. My name is Zeus. <laughs> Need a mem I've come here looking for my daughter. I haven't um, seen her for many years. She's, she's just like, about your a dude age. versus really? like another dude bro is like, yo, are you vape? So like, yeah, I vape. And then sometimes. they're just having bus sex. I wish I had some <laughs> friends, but as you can see, there are too many like, people on this island. Yeah. Ronnie, yeah, like how can you easily be like best dude just because you do the same fucking things? Like, hey, do you eat? You mean the lab? Yeah, I eat. You know it? What? <laughs> what great. I, I will say because I my like if you want. That would be Like perfect. because basically Let's vaping go. has become this thing associated with people trying to be cool. When you meet someone who vapes and is a normal person, it's the best thing in the world. <laughs> you you like like that person way more. <laughs> yeah, I vape, but I don't I don't like talking about it. <laughs> no, it's like like it's like meeting someone who's into games or anime and who can socialize properly <laughs> oh you mean like that wrestler guy yeah like all those wrestler guys yeah. dude i was Why do you live on listening to the call for a podcast well, and to. who's the guy from yeah xavier woods he's like care of the graves, he's I'm getting sorry. like so many wrestlers to be a great like keeper. professional and amateur into like otaku there. shit he's just like yo I watch this anime it's super good <laughs> Have, so, I'm have sorry, you Ronnie. seen the Kenny no, Omega me. Excellent Adventure? Not many people no. live here really anymore. Someone what, has what to take like? care of the huh? graves. What is they? They're them playing so Street Fighter, and Kenny Omega is a Japanese pro wrestler from the Bullet Club. <gasps> <Where>? <gasps> <gasps> it sounds, it sounds real good. 
It belongs to my I can't wife. wait. I really hope that this like influx of nerds into you know WWE is going to make it ridiculous no. as it should be. I want so okay, so can you make I want time travel and I want soul transfer so to fucking make it happen. I want I want someone to like put his hand over someone else's face and he's then like hypnotized. Or like, or like someone does like a, a um, Kenshiro like arm wave with after image behind it and like he hypnotizes someone and he's then like forced to follow him and then he makes him like attack the Undertaker and then like that takes heat off him and it just becomes this whole huge thing. I, w I wanted to get as ridiculous and convoluted as it could be.